Hello all today i will tell you a beautiful story with a huge morality that the name of a person is just a word to identify him but not always true for his deeds uh, the name of this story is a man named ashist now ashist means bad let us start the story once upon a time there was a famous teacher in takshila in northwestern india he had one of these students had been named ashist by his parents whenever anybody called him ashish come here or can you do this ashish he did not feel nice i wonder why my parents named me ashish he would always ask himself sadly one day he went to his teacher and said sir i don't feel nice about my name others do not feel good calling me by this name neither do i like hearing it so many times in a day he said Please give me another name a more pleasant one he requested the teacher the teacher replied my son i grant you leave for a week go wherever you want to outside this ashram find a suitable name for yourself when you come back i will officially give you your new name so ashishta left the teacher's ashram and started walking on the road not knowing where it would take him he reached a big city and came across a house where he heard people crying because someone had died he asked a man standing there what was the name of the man who died the man replied jeevit ashist oh he remarked sounding shocked the person whose name is jeevi died the people standing around said whether a person's name is jeevi or mrityu he has to die one day a name is only a word to identify a person after hearing this ashishta walked away from there not feeling so bad about his name not feeling good about it either as he walked through the city he came across a girl who was being shouted at by a man on the road he ran to stop the man and asked him why he was doing so the man told him that she was a poor girl who had borrowed a lot of money from him but had not returned it the girl had promised to repay him by working for him but was neither good doing that nor returning his money he asked him what the girl's name was and the man replied dhani oh a person whose name is dhani is so poor he asked in surprise the people standing around replied whether her name be dhani or nirdhani the fact is that she has no money a name is only a word to identify a person on hearing this so ashishta walked away from there and felt less bad about his name after walking for a few hours he saw a man he saw a man approaching him from the opposite direction looking helpless the man spoke in a harried tone i have lost my way will you please help me ashishta nodded to show him that he was all ready to help him and guide him to his destination he asked the man what's your name the man replied margadarshak what asked ashist amazed to hear the name your name is margadarshak and you have lost your way the man answered whether my name be margadarshak or paryatak the fact is that i have lost my way a name is only a word to identify a person now completely satisfied with his name ashist returned to his teacher The teacher was happy to see him. Come dear, have you found a name for yourself? Ashishta replied, "Sir, I have found the answer to my question. Now I now understand that a name is merely a word to recognize a person. I have realized that a rose by any other name would smell as sweet. I, it is not my name but my deeds that makes me good or bad." I am not going to change my name. Thank you for teaching me this lesson, sir. So, 
so this is about the story uh, that is so that uh, merely tells us about the so morality that name is just a word to identify a person so but his deeds makes him good or bad thank you dear students